Mounting a bicycle is the one topic everyone who has ever ridden a bike can relate to. If you're a beginner, you might start with both legs over the top tube, and then step onto the pedals like this. As a short person, I'm rarely clearing any top tube. And if I'm being honest, this method just seems to require a lot of unnecessary steps. The quickest way to get on a bike is to just jump on, either by landing directly on the pedals or directly onto the seat. While jumping on is quick, I wouldn't expect everyone to mount their bicycle this way, especially with the seat way up. I see a lot of riders put their foot on the pedal while lifting the bike off the ground. They then use their other foot to push off and get going. Also, not a bad technique. But in my opinion, only one method reigns supreme. The step and swing technique. To do this, just put your foot on the pedal closest to you. Then push off to get the bike going. Done as one fluid motion, it looks legit. It's also objectively more stable than the other methods and probably requires the least amount of energy. This would explain why 70% of my audience mounts their bike this way. But does it matter? No, of course not. Not unless you ride cyclocross. Or maybe you're a commuter and want to choose the method easiest to perform in work clothes. Or perhaps you like to make things as difficult as possible. Even though I polled you already, I want to know which method you guys like the best. Let me know in the comments. Thanks for riding with me today, and I'll see you next time.